Scorpio, and welcome to my channel. I hope that all of my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios out there are doing well. All right, you guys, we're gonna pull for my sex world because I ain't, I ain't did no sex talk, I ain't did none of that in a little while. So, you know, let's, let's see what's going on here between you and somebody else, okay? So, if anything resonates, Scorpio, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Ooh, Scorpio, don't forget to. <laughs> Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you're interested in a personal, my email will be in the description box below. All right, Scorpio. So somebody want, want you to let them suck on that thing, okay? They're saying, shit, Scorpio. I'm thirsty, baby. I need to come suck on that mug, okay? Somebody want to come suck on that thing right quick, okay? Shit, they might want to do 69 while they doing it, okay? So somebody want you to... See, either you want to, Scorpio, or somebody want to come suck on that thing, okay? And they, shit, they might want to do a little 69, why you know y'all out here doing this shit, okay? So this could be something somebody been thinking about. Maybe you been thinking about it, Scorpio. It's been a while, you know, since somebody done stuck on that thing, you know? All right, tell us more. For some of you, there is someone in your energy that you feel like either this person is the best sex that you've ever had or vice versa. But either way it is, Scorpio, you feel like this person bring out the freaking you like, Every time you and this person, you know what I'm saying, get it in, it's like you find yourself doing some old freaky ass shit. You're like, damn, I don't even do this type shit. You know what I'm saying? So somebody could be like bringing out a freak in you, okay? But it's, it's really because you're becoming comfortable with this person. You know, you're becoming comfortable with, with their body and vice versa. They're becoming comfortable with yours. Some of you guys, there's an emotional connection here, a very, a lot of chemistry, a very lot of chemistry, a lot of chemistry between you and this person but she this person for some of you guys is the best sex that you've ever had and they really brought out the freak in you okay this might i want to know if you playing with yourself and shit okay so this person want to want you like to send them pictures of you or they always asking you you like shit scorpio are you playing with yourself i know you think about me you know they're playing with yourself or now nah. okay so let's get into it scorpio let's pull some more let's see what it is that spirit needs you to know Hold on, that's the school texting. I already know here they ain't got no dogs on school tomorrow. So somebody either you, Scorpio, or the best sex that they've ever had or vice versa, okay? But whoever this is, baby, you bring out the freak. And this person bring out the freak in you or you bring out the freak in them, okay? So let's see where this reading going to go from there. That was interesting. All right, messages for my Scorpios, Holy Spirit. What is it that my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios, what do they need to know? What does Scorpio need to know, Holy Spirit? What does Scorpio need to know? Ah, Lord, we got Ray Charles up here, Scorpio, all right? Somebody blind. Now, I ain't going to say that because Scorpio, somebody could really be blind. But I just feel like this is the energy of somebody who some shit was unknown to this person. So I feel like somebody was blind to some shit, okay? They weren't able to see through some, okay? Maybe this person wasn't able to see through the bullshit, okay? Something was unknown, something that they did not know about, okay? So there's a blind, okay? Somebody was blind. They had their blinders on. And because they were blind, they was walking around, you know, acting blind to some shit. It was like they weren't able to see some shit. They weren't able to see through someone or something here. Tell us more, Holly Spirit. Messages for my Scorpios. What does Scorpio need to know? This could be a male energy. All right, we have idea. Okay, so Scorpio, you've received some type of vision. Okay, there is some type of light bulb that went off. Okay, some of you, maybe you do run a business online or maybe Spirit is encouraging you to, you know, look into running your business here online. I feel like something has given you some type of inspiration, okay? You could be looking to other people online to give you, you know, inspiration to give you some type of idea for this vision or this dream that spirit has given you. You could be 41 years old right now. Tell us more, Holly Spirit. 
or this can happen when you're 41, Scorpio. I don't know. Messages for my Scorpio. Tell us more. What is it that my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios, what do they need to know? So someone, someone was blind to something, okay? Tell us more, Holy Spirit. This is somebody they thought they could trust, okay? So someone here was blind to some shit. I feel like someone here was blind to someone's intentions, okay? Someone here, they, they were not able to see some shit because they were so blind. Maybe they were blinded by love or something. But they were unable to see someone's true intentions, okay? They thought this was somebody they can trust. They thought this person was being honest with them. They thought this was someone they were compatible with, okay? So maybe they felt... They feel like someone else was their true love or, you know, they were more compatible with this person versus being with you. Or maybe you feel like you're more compatible with somebody else versus being with somebody. Being with this this person. Yeah, I don't know why I can't talk. What was that? First quarter moon was just, I remember the other day, I was like, what moon cycle is it? Because it seemed like when the moon cycle see, I can't talk work for them. I don't know what it got to do with my speech, but it affects it. So someone here tried to create an alliance with someone, okay? And whoever this person was, I mean, they tried to collaborate. They tried to join forces with somebody, okay? They thought they were more compatible with this person. They thought this person was going to be more honest with them, but they could trust this person, okay? They were trustworthy here. All right, so tell us more then, Holy Spirit. What is it that Scorpio needs to know? I know this Scorpio. I love you, Scorpio. <laughs> Maybe I need to go see some of The other day I had to stop and give me a little Lamarita or something. I had to get this tongue twisting out, Lord. Okay. What does Scorpio need to know, Holy Spirit? Tell us more. All right. Now someone is experiencing an overload, okay? Some type of obligation, something they're dealing with is really overwhelming them. Maybe someone here, their workload is overwhelming. Something that they feel they're obligated to deal with. That situation could be overwhelming here. It's like they've reached their breaking point. Tell us more. I feel like after being blind to some shit, I feel like someone now is reaching their breaking point in a situation. Tell us more how to feel. We're going to clarify this. Yeah. And now they're ready. They're preparing. I feel like for some type of new beginning here. Okay, look at this. Somebody is ready, like somebody is preparing for this new beginning. You can be 44. This person can be 41. You can be 44. I ain't hitting nothing. Okay, so let's pull. Let's pull a little bit of tarot. Let's see what this, let's see what's going on here. Because we got somebody that was blind to some shit. This could have been you or this could have been this person, okay? Somebody was blind to something, okay, a situation, a person, something that they were dealing with in the past, okay, it's fear could have gave this person a vision, or maybe this is someone who sees things like through dreams here, but whoever this was, they tried to join forces with this person, okay, so they tried to team up with this person here, but they realized, shit, that obligation, them teaming up with that person was more stressful, it was more overwhelming, than what they thought, okay? So this could have been, I'm seeing a seven of pentacles. Somebody here invested, you know, a lot of time, a lot of energy. They dedicated a lot of time and energy. Really in the wrong person. They really had some stress out when it was all said and done here. So we're going to clarify blind. We're going to see who this person is that was blind to some shit, okay? Messages for Scorpios, Holy Spirit. Tell us about blind. Clarify blind, Holy Spirit. Who was this person that was blind? Clarify blinds, nine of pentacles. Mm. So this is someone who felt like money could have bought them happiness. Okay, so this is someone who, remember in that last reading I did, someone felt like another or a better opportunity was presented to them. Okay, some of you just could have been a Virgo. This could have been someone who felt like a better opportunity was presented to them, maybe a better financial opportunity or someone they feel like they can get money with. Okay, because remember, they joined forces with somebody. And whoever they collaborated with, they thought they were this, this person was going to get money together, okay? They was going to get money. They was going to make money together. But I don't think that's what the fuck they got. Yep, they lost money. Or, or if this person did have money, they realized, shit, this money couldn't buy them love. This money couldn't buy them happiness. So this is someone they've lost. Whoever they tried to join forces with, 
really cause them to lose a lot of money here. Tell us more, Holy Spirit, about this nine of pentacles. So they were blind to the fact they thought, like I said, this person was going to be honest with them. They can trust them. Tell us more, Holy Spirit. Tell us about this alliance. That's what I want to know. And whoever this person was, they thought they loved them. Look at that, look at that green. They thought they was going to get money with this person because they trust this person. They love this person. They thought, okay, you know, me and this person, we can really do this. We can get this money together. We can live this, this lavish life together. Like, we can do a big, you know? But shit, they didn't do shit. They lost big money. Tell us about this alliance, Holy Spirit. Look at this. Four of Cups. Yeah. This is somebody who I feel like, even though they tried to join forces with this person, like, Spirit was trying to show them, like, uh-uh. That ain't who you want to join forces with, okay? Spirit presented with presented to you, Scorpio, was like, you may need to join forces with Scorpio here. And this person was like, oh, nah, Scorpio ain't got, you know what I'm saying, nothing that I need. This person felt like, you know, that that, that you can provide them with what they needed. They, they felt like they weren't interested, you know what I'm saying? They weren't interested in that offer. But now this person is. Why? Because they're ready. They're ready for a new beginning. And once they get ready for this new beginning, they realize, they realize the only person they can have a new beginning with, the only person they can experience what they thought they had in this person is going to be within you. See, they're going to be ready for that. But the thing is, Scorpio, you protected yourself, okay? You, you, you stay in your ground. You stood your ground with this person. You are protecting yourself. You can be meditating right now, doing yoga. You're doing things to protect your energy because you realize how important your energy is and how your energy must be protected. So whoever this person is, you have protected yourself. Some of you guys, maybe you called up on your trust and ancestors and spirit guides and you've asked them specifically, like, protect me from this person. You know what I'm saying? You could be dealing with a Cancer, a Virgo, or a Leo. Tell us more, Holy Spirit. Who did they join forces with? Who did they think they was going to be able to get this money with, Holy Spirit? Let me ask this. Who did they join forces with, Holy Spirit? Who did they think they were going to get this money with? Who did they join forces with? Hmm. Somebody that deceived them. Somebody who possibly stole from them. So whoever this person was, remember, they... they Took some type of financial loss with this five of pentacles, okay? So whoever this person was, they actually realized that they actually fucked around and stole from this person, okay? Seven of cups energy. I mean, shit. I'm sorry, this seven of cups. My bad. Hello, Scorpio. Yeah, whoever this was that they joined forces with, whoever this was that they teamed up with, Scorpio, shit, this is somebody who they weren't unable. They weren't able to see through this person's bullshit you know what i'm saying like this is someone who created some type of illusion they was like if you join forces with me you team up with me you be with me see we can get this money okay because when you met this person or during the time that you were dealing with the scorpio your money may not have been good you still could have been struggling finance you know what i'm saying you were still trying to find your way and this person you could have shared this with this person you know or this person knew that they, they knew that you were still trying to find your way they didn't feel like they were going to find that financial stability with you because with this nine of pentacles coming out first, okay, I feel like this person felt like they were going to be able to get money. Like, this person all was on their mind, like, was money. They were money hungry. And they team forces with somebody, that shit really, they, they took a financial loss. You know what I'm saying? They, they, this person stole from them, and they took some type of financial loss dealing with this person. Let's get one more. Messages for my Scorpio. Tell us more. Yeah, with this person, see, they chose money over love. For some of you, that last reading, it talked about choosing a convenient situation over love. Okay, and for some of you, that's what they did. They chose this money. This person they thought they can join forces with, team up with. They chose this person over you because you were the person who they really could experience true love with. Someone who was going to give their cup of love. You was going to give your cup of love to this person. And then in return, they were supposed to give it back to you. This was supposed to be this new beginning. In love. And see, now this person got to train. Now they got to prepare for this. When all along, they had this shit right here in front of them. But they were too busy trying to team up and trying to join forces with this evil third party that wound up stealing from them and leaving them with nothing here, okay? All right, so you could be dealing with a Cancer Scorpio or Pisces. We got Scorpio, Leo, 
Cancer, and Virgo. So let's roll and see who this reading is about. Messages for my Scorpios, Holy Spirit. Who is this about? We got Heavy Virgo, Capricorn, Aquarius. We got Cancer, Capricorn, Scorpio, Sag. And we also have Aquarius, Taurus, Pisces, and Leo. All right, you guys, I love you. And until next time, stay blessed.